So guys, I've been I've been watching Manny Pacquiao's camp very closely, and I'm a bit confused to who Pacquiao's trainer is, and I hope that doesn't cause um, trouble in his camp. There is there is a a lot of red flags, you know, um, in Pacquiao's camp. Uh, we don't know who his trainer is. We don't know who he's who's who's giving the instructions. Some people say Boo Boy, some people say Freddie Roach. Freddie Roach is talking like he's the trainer. Uh, but it seems to me like in the footage, uh, it seems to me like Boo Boy is taking charge of the sessions. Uh, I made a video about this before and I hope it doesn't cause confusion and friction in Pacquiao's camp because I do know that Boo Boy wasn't happy that Freddie Roach was coming back into camp. I think he wants to be fully in charge. He feels like after he led Pacquiao, uh, in the Matisse fight and Pacquiao had one of his best performance in years that he should be given the the nod for being the trainer but you know Pacquiao once wanted Freddie Roach back in the corner but I don't know whether he's the lead trainer or whether he's going to be doing what he did with Tyson Fury and that's you know not not fully in charge obviously I know that pa uh, Freddie Roach his health isn't what it used to be and and you know he's not able to communicate as he used to when he was a lot younger uh, so I don't know whether that's why you know other the the other fighters that he works with have someone else as the main trainer and have him there just for his knowledge and experience. But it, I hope it doesn't cause friction in Pacquiao's camp because I don't think they're all on terms. It, when he was in there with Tyson Fury, they were all on terms. You know Ben Davison and Freddie Roach, uh, Ricky Yatt, and they all respected Ben Davison respected Freddie Roach a lot. But I think Boo Boy. I, from from what I from what I hear from the interviews, I don't think he gets on well with Freddie Roach, or maybe he just feels that uh, he should be given charge. And I think there's a little bit of friction there. So I hope that doesn't. I listen. I think Pacquiao beats Broner anyway, uh, but I just think there shouldn't be any friction. And as moving forward, you know, Pacquiao needs to know who's his trainer. Is it is it Boo Boy? Is it Freddie Roach? Because at this stage in Pacquiao's career, you know, he needs the right guidance, not just the guidance in, in terms of what is in the ring, the tactics and whatever, you know, it's the other things that if Pacquiao's not the fighter he was, especially if he fights someone a lot more tougher and, and he's not the fighter and he gets hurt, you know, for the trainer to say, you know what, that cares for Pacquiao and say, you know what, I think your time's done. Because Pacquiao is coming to that time of his career where, you know, tough decisions are going to be have to made, be made by his trainer, by, you know, they, they may have to say, listen, Pacquiao, you haven't got what it what it takes anymore, so it's time for you to hang it up. You know, Pacquiao is coming to that stage of his career where you know those kind of conversations may have to take place, especially if he loses, if he loses to Broner, if he goes and loses to somebody else, gets knocked out, anything you know, anything's possible. So these you have to look at who's the best man for Pacquiao's interest right now. Um, I don't know. I don't know what's going on in the camp. I don't know who's training, but from what the from what the photos and the way the sessions are going, it seems to me like Boo Boy's in charge. Uh, Freddie Roach doesn't seem to me like he's taking charge now. I don't know. I know Boo Boy used to do a lot of the strength and strength and conditioning, um, or he used to he used to go with runs with Pacquiao and he used to do a lot of that side of it, uh, the cardio side of it. And I, I, Freddie Roach used to take um, Pacquiao on the pads, but. I don't think Freddie Roach is able to do that anymore. So I don't know whether who's going to be the trainer. If you guys know, leave me, let me know in the comment section below. I don't know who's going to be the actual trainer of Pacquiao. Who's going to be giving the instructions? Is it going to be Boo Boy or is it going to be Freddie Roach? I don't know. Uh, but I hope that it doesn't cause any conflict or it affects Pacquiao's performance. I don't think it will uh, because Pacquiao, as we know, is a is a professional. He's very good at what he does. So I don't think that will affect him. But moving forward, I do think it's important that he knows who his trainer is and who's going to be giving the instructions. I'm pretty sure he knows. Um, but the fact the fact is, when you got someone like Freddie Roach there, what do you want him there? Do you want him there just as a sideshow? Do you want him to be actually running the show? That's the thing. Or is he able to do that? Uh, but leave your thoughts guys. Let me know what you think about this whole situation and guys remember to please like share and subscribe to my channel I'll see you guys in the next video